Poor saps. One take. So oleosaccharum directly translates from the Latin meaning oily sugar. The leftover clementine peels, lemon peels, and lime peel. You can do lemons, you can just do lime, or you can do the combo like I did. Take your rinds and just cover those in sugar. Apply our lid. Make sure that's airtight. Give that a shake. And in about 24 hours, all that sugar solidified at the bottom, but the oils get extracted. That is the liquid gold. That's resting. It's going under an osmosis process, and the result is a flavor-packed elevated syrup. To Jerry Thomas, this is like the first written account of a bartender's guide. He specifically said, to make punch of any sort in perfection, the ambrosial essence of the lemon must be extracted. So a lot of bartenders, they'll say, let's add some essence. So I think we need to differentiate between an actual zest of oil and what essence really is. It's a much more involved, thorough process that gives you a more elevated syrup. I have not tasted this batch yet. I mean, the, the, the flavor is so complex. Like, you don't even need a lot. If, you, if you're making a cocktail, all you need is maybe an ounce of this stuff and whatever spirit you're going with, and you're good to go. Spirit drinkers, go two ounces of your favorite spirit, one and a half ounce water, and three fourth ounces of oleo. Thank me later. And there you go, man. Oleo saccharum. And yes, you have to say it like that. Speaking of syrup, did y'all hear about that maple syrup company them guys had to shut down?